We're just at the uh, Toby Carvery opposite the Pole Hill Garden Centre at um, Pole Hill in Kent. Uh, that's um, Badger's Mount uh, way. And uh, there's a new uh, polar charging station here. There's actually another one in the uh, opposite in the uh, garden centre, the Pole Hill Garden Centre. Uh, it's a bit strange, got one over there and one over here across the road, but uh, ne nevertheless. Um, so I'm using CCS, uh, had the CCS upgrade uh, done yesterday, you can see it there with the adapter and you can see the car flashing away. And we're getting um, at about a 50%, uh, 55% state of charge. I'm uh, getting, uh, what's that, 100, oh, 95 amps, 36 kilowatt was 103 a minute or so so that uh, that seems to work fine that's uh, good to know uh, very good to know so uh, might uh, just carry on and uh, that's steering wheel position there carry on and uh, go down to um, the genie point and see if uh, see if that works okay as well okay I'm at uh, Ballantyne's in um uh, Sid Cup Stroke Orpington, not quite sure where it is on the border. I think it's probably Orpington. And uh, there's a couple of uh, charge point uh, Winstervolt uh, units here. So I've just plugged in the CCS again. And um, I think it's all flashing away. Uh, pretty easy authentication on the Apple Watch app, for the Charge Point Plus, which I installed when I was at Apple because the uh, company um, charge points were there but it's it's obviously charging away I'm just going to have a look inside the car and uh, see um, see what's going on see what sort of rate we're getting and, uh, yeah it's pretty all right 39 kilowatts at 56 percent the 50 kilowatt charger so uh, yeah all, all good, all good indeed. So, uh, yeah, it seems the CCS adapter is uh, working fine. I'll try one more. I'll try a charge point uh, genie, which I have a card for that. Um, yeah, I've got a genie card. I think you can use the app as well. But yeah, I've got, got one of those. So we're going to go and try that next. And there is a DBT unit uh, that's a bit further away, so I don't really want to drive over there. But I think if, uh, if it's a three out of three, I'll, I'll say this... Uh, CC upgrade, CCS upgrade has been uh, perfectly okay. So now at the uh, Charge Point Genie uh, station at uh, Orpington Chipfield Road, Texaco Garage, and uh, all seems to be working okay again. Let's see what uh, we're getting. Um, oh, quite, quite, yeah, uh, 28 kilowatts at the minute. It's ramping up to. Uh, 100 and, oh, we've got 111 amps or so, 41 kilowatts, actually the highest so far. State of charge is um, around about 56%. So uh, yeah, that's, um, that worked well. I've got a card which I've had for some time. And uh, yeah, so uh, yeah, three out of three so far with the uh, test of the CCS uh, upgrade works very well so we'll just stop this um, one thing I did notice the um, charge point didn't charge me because uh, I only uh, took about a kilowatt or so for the test didn't actually charge me so um, trying to get this to stop now maybe I have to use the uh, card again to stop it let's hold the card up again and see what happens a bit confusing how do you stop it do you put language start stop? I'll hit the start stop button. Combo. I oh, see. You got to press the. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh, well, that's a bit, a bit awkward, isn't it? Oh, so got to do that again. Yeah, I wouldn't have said uh, user friendly, but nevertheless, it uh, it's worked fa fine taking about a kilowatt. Um, there is a pop point nearby as well. I'm not sure if that's a rapid or not, but um, we'll soon see, we'll soon find out. Well, just a quick uh, final there. The uh, last uh, 
charging station was indeed two pod points, but they were, uh, you know, in front of a company and looked like they were for um, staff and visitors. They're obviously free to use, but they're on the charge port, uh, sorry, the pod point uh, map and on the Tesla Nav map. So a little bit, uh, well, at least on Google, so a little bit confusing as to whether you're really meant to use them or not. But uh, anyway, that was in um, uh, St. Paul's Cray, Orpington. Anyway, I think three out of three, uh, you know, uh, uh, Instavolt, charge point in other words, um, charge point genie, or genie point, and uh, polar, all three works. We've got quite a lot of polars around here now. I'm amazed they're appearing at garden centres and all sorts of things, so, um, and pubs. So, uh, yeah. Uh, anyway, three out of three for CCS, which is a lot better ratio than I got, uh, you know, sort of, four out of five broken when we actually were going going somewhere but certainly uh, in the area of Orpington all the rapids I've uh, tried and I've used CCS in each case work perfectly well with the um, uh, Tesla uh, uh, CCS update on a 2016 car uh, pre-facelift and uh, of course the uh, Tesla adapter so yeah um, I uh, can't see any evidence of any issues with the uh, update I've had done.